Hello, welcome back to Java Programming. In this video, we are going to see a program in which we are going to add the numbers in a series. In the previous programs, we have created odd numbers, even numbers, and the sequence of numbers 1 to 100 and all. So this program is uh, is to find the sum of series, a series of numbers. So uh, we are going to create a class here. The name of class is uh, uh, sum sum of numbers. Sum of numbers. So class name in a class name you are not supposed to give space in between. If you give space, it will make error. The reason is it's a token. So token is token should be uh, without any space and you can have uh, alpha numerical values and uh, certain special characters if needed but this is the style of giving uh, the starting alphabet should be caps that is the java convention of writing uh, java programs in the classes and of course this is a console input output program so we need the main method so we can include that as well and click finish so the template program for creating this program is uh, ready and it is made by eclipse for us and so here in this program we can um, declare some variables in i for making the series so the aim of the program is to find the sum of numbers from 1 to 100 so first of all we are going to create the series and we are going to add it okay let us start the program in this way for i will be having a initial value 0 i less than or equal to 100 semicolon i plus plus and this is the body of the for construct so this is the body of the for construct so whatever you are going to give uh, within this opening and closing braces so it is going to be executed continuously uh, depends upon the exit condition of the for loop so uh, for i equal to 0 i than or equal to 100 and i plus plus i plus plus is a uh, incremental value and this is the initial value and the second one is going to be the final value so you can print it out Uh, we can print system dot out dot print line and give i here oh, yeah so in this program uh, in this program if you execute suppose we will get a series of soft numbers from 0 to 100 let us run and see yeah it is giving all the numbers from 0 to 100 of course our aim is to add the numbers uh, there won't be any difference if you add 0 or not so better we will start on because if you add 0 with that sum it won't make any difference and how to find the sum for finding the sum along with this program this is uh, now this program is to generate a series of numbers from 1 to 100 if you want to find the sum we should have a variable for sum and we have to declare it in sum and we can initialize it as 0 so initially the sum value is 0 that means we have been started adding it so here when you generate 1 by 1 numbers here we can add it so initial value of sum is anyhow 0 then we are going to add every sum value no the sum value with the every generated values of i okay the idea is initial value of i is going to be 1 initial value of sum is going to be 0 so this 1 is added with the sum so the sum value will be 1 again in the next iteration the i value is going to be 2 the 2 is going to add with sum and at present sum is having a value of 1 1 plus 2 is 3 now the sum is having the value 3 
I also got incremented to 3 and 3 plus 3, 6 is going to be there in sum. Now I will be having 4, so on. So every time this value is getting incremented. And if you want to see that exactly, you can give it um, value value of sum value of sum equal to then give sum plus value of i equal to plus i yeah. something wrong yeah it's a string and i have to give it in the double quotes and here i close the double quotes yeah. let us see what is going to happen in this program okay let me save and run let us see the program support see the initial value of sum equal to zero yeah that's what we have declared here but the value of i equal to one so i is being added with sum and now the current value of i is one at a time the value of i got incremented to two that two and one is added and the sums value got three i also incremented from two to three so every time i value is going to be incremented one by one so sum is going to get a value that is the previous sum value plus the present i value that is being added and finally we are going to get the total value of sum so this we have to add this 100 as well here then we will get the uh, actual sum so in this program there is no need to uh, display all the in between values so this is a comment statement in comment this is a comment in the java programming so this line of code will not execute that's why i put double slashes and i want to print it here after the for loop after the execution of for loop all the numbers generated in the sequence will be added with sum and here i want to print it system dot out dot print line it is going to have value actually we want to print the sum so let us give some caption as well sum sum equal to uh, plus and sum yeah this sum is just a string and this is a variable we are not supposed to give capital s here if you give upper case s it will give error sum cannot be resolved to a variable because we haven't declared sum so this sum and this sum both are different so the java is case sensitive in nature so you are not supposed to change the cases we have to give the case as it is let us run and see the program 5050 that's a sum of numbers from 1 to 100 okay this is the problem to find the sum number series okay please type this program and uh, try it in your compiler and if you find any difficulty or if you need any clarification regarding this program please feel free to contact me my email id is it underscore teacher1 at yahoo.com it underscore teacher1 at yahoo.com thank you for watching this video have a nice day bye